Humility 2. In a narration found in Sahih Muslim, number 265, the Holy Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, warned that a person who possesses even an atom's worth of pride in their spiritual heart will not enter paradise. He clarified that pride is when a person rejects the truth and looks down on others. No amount of good deeds will benefit someone who possesses pride. This is quite obvious when one observes the devil and how his countless years of worship did not benefit him when he became proud. In fact, the following verse clearly connects pride with disbelief. So a Muslim must avoid this evil characteristic at all costs. Chapter 2 Al-Baqarah, verse 34. And mention when we said to the angels prostrate before Adam, so they prostrated except for Iblis. He refused and was arrogant and became of the disbelievers. The proud is the one who rejects the truth when it is presented to them simply because it did not come from them and as it challenges their desires and mentality. The proud person also believes they are superior to others even though they are unaware of their real status in the eyes of Allah, the exalted. They may believe they are great because of the few insincere and imperfect good deeds they have done while they are disliked by Allah, the exalted, because of their many sins. In addition, Looking down upon others is foolish as one is unaware of their own ultimate end and the ultimate end of others. Meaning the person they look down upon may well die as a sincere Muslim whereas they may die as a disbeliever. In reality, it is foolish to be proud of anything seeing as Allah, the Exalted, created and granted everything a person owns. Even the righteous deeds one performs are only due to the inspiration, knowledge and strength granted by Allah, the Exalted. Therefore, being proud of something which does not innately belong to oneself is plain foolishness. This is just like a person who becomes proud over a mansion they do not even own or live in. This is the reason why pride belongs to Allah, the Exalted, as He alone is the Creator and innate owner of all things. The one who challenges Allah, the Exalted, in pride will be thrown into hell. This has been confirmed in a narration found in Sunan Abu Dawood, number 4090. A Muslim should instead follow in the footsteps of the Holy Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, and adopt humility. The humble truly recognize that all the good they possess and all the evil they are protected from comes from no one except Allah, the Exalted. Therefore, humility is more fitting for a person than pride. A person should not be fooled into believing humility leads to disgrace, as no one has been more honored than the humble servants of Allah, the Exalted. In fact, the Holy Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, has guaranteed an increase in status for the one who adopts humility for the sake of Allah, the Exalted, in a narration found in Jami RT Z, number 2029. A humble person accepts the truth, irrespective of who it comes from, as they know the source of truth is none other than Allah, the Exalted. Instead of looking down on others, they look at others with the eye of mercy and compassion and support this with sincere actions, all the while hoping Allah, the Exalted, will look upon them with mercy and compassion. They understand that one will be treated by Allah, the Exalted, according to how they treat others. This has been indicated in a narration found in Sahih Bukhari, number 7376. Over 400 free ebooks, audiobooks, infographics, podcasts, and blogs available on our website, www.shakepod.com.